Hello. Haven't done a video in a while, but I just got kind of a holy grail acquisition for me. Uh, I wanted to do a quick video to sort of show it off right out of the box before I start uh, restoring it a bit. Um, it's a uh, fair warning. It's not a TRS-80 acquisition. It's actually a, a digital VT100 terminal. And I want to explain why I uh, have uh, looked for this for so long and it's not just any VT100 terminal. So to understand why I was looking for this terminal, um, this is Westfield High School in Westfield, Massachusetts where I went to school and the little narrow windows on the first floor between the two stairwells is where the computer room was at this high school even in the early 80s. It contained a PDP 1170 and a whole bunch of terminals. And this would seem a little bit odd uh, at this time to have this much hardware for a bunch of high school students. But the reason was the town of Westfield, Massachusetts was where digital, one of Digital's manufacturing plants for the VT100 terminal was uh, situated. Here's a picture of the factory. So here we go. Um, this is the terminal that I just got. Um, just took it out of the box. You can see it's a little yellow, but all the keys are there. It's actually a real VT100. Quite yellowed, needs a lot of cleanup. I have no idea if it works. I have not turned it on. Um, it, will, it will get cleaned out before I actually turned it on and completely checked out so I don't cause any problem. Picture tubes intact. Structure looks good. The bottom's not rusted. Um, here's the connections on the back and um, you can actually see here. Well, let's zoom in a little bit about why I bought this um, This was manufactured in September of 1982 in Westfield, Massachusetts I've looked for a long time to find one of these that was actually manufactured where I grew up. There's the model information sort of um, and again Westfield, Mass. Uh, super excited to track this down. Really really interesting. So before I kick off, I'd like to show what you'd actually do with this. This is a replica of a PDP-1170 I have, and it's connected up to a VT-320, which is the oldest terminal I've restored. Um, and here you can see it's uh, logging into Ristis, which is what I would have done when I was in high school. Uh, your user was 1, 2 or something. Um, and I attach to uh, no job. I just hit return and start up again. And you can do things like dir, and a lot of what we did on these terminals was basic programming um, on the mainframe. Uh, you can see I don't have this quite set up yet. Uh, the the backslash deletes are sort of what the deck writers did, but you, um, I could get that fixed. And I just log out just to give you a flavor of uh, that. And the light pattern there is what Ristis does when it's idle. So thanks for watching. Um, I plan to get this thing apart and uh, check it out if it works and clean it up and see what else is is wrong or whether I can get it to run. But it's uh, kind of exciting to finally track this down after so many years. <laughs> Take care.